Hi guys, welcome to a hey Math group. So we have the following question. Basically, we need to build the equation of the line and they give me these two points. This point and this point. Anytime you need to build the equation of the line and they give you two points, the first step is to find the slope. Remember, the slope is is found by um, by using the following formula y2 minus y1 and then x2 minus x1 this is x1 y1 this is x2 y2 perfect so let's go ahead and plug these numbers here so i have 3 minus 5 and then on the bottom i have 2 minus minus 4 because remember this negative is right here so you always need to respect the signs 3 minus 5 is equals to negative 2. Negative times negative is a positive, so this becomes 2 plus 4, which is equals to 6. And then I need to simplify, and this is negative 1 third. Perfecto. Now that I have my slope, I can go ahead and find the equation of the line by using any point. Well, I'm going to choose the easiest one, the one that does not have negative signs. So I can actually use this formula, the y minus y1, or I can just use the y equals mx plus b. This is how I like doing it because that way I can just get my b. In this case, I have y equals m, which is the slope, x, which is just x, and then b. That is basically what I'm looking for. So I'm going to go ahead and plug what I have. I'm going to pick this point and I'm going to do 3 equals and then m is negative 1, 3, x is equals to 2 because look, I have a 2 here, plus b. That's basically what I'm looking for. Now, I'm going to clean this up and I do multiplication of fractions. 2 times negative 1 is negative 2, 3 times 1 is just 3 plus b, and I want to go ahead and clean this up. I hate fractions. You probably hate fractions too. I'm going to go ahead and multiply every single term by 3. That way I can eliminate this fraction. I can do whatever I want as long as I do it to every single term. So let's do it. 3 times 3 is equals to 9 equals negative 2 over 3 times 3, the 3's will eliminate. So you only get 2. And finally, 3 times b is just 3. By the way, if you move the negative 2 over 3 to the other side, you will get the same answer. So now I have an easier um, a linear function. So I just move the 2 here by just adding both sides. And I get 11 equals to 3b. Finally, b equals 2. I divide by 3 on both sides, and this is 11 over 3. Awesome. I have my slope and my y-intercept. I just plug it in. Remember, y equals mx plus b, and this is negative 1 third x plus 11 over 3, and voila. Please don't forget to watch our other videos. Also remember, you can Skype with us. And also, thanks so much for learning.